Hi everybody, um, in this lesson I'm gonna draw a old blues guy, a blues guitar player. So um, I've got a really really rough sketch here and so I'm gonna just attempt to hammer it out right here. Um, so first thing I'm gonna do is grab a quick brush. I am gonna speed this thing up in a moment but I wanted to just uh, quickly um, sort of get you started on this how I put this together um, so I'm, I've got another layer here and I'm gonna actually kind of just clean them up a little bit so what you can see here is they're essentially we've got shapes going on here um, so anything that you want to draw it's it's just built on shapes um, so right here you know we've got um, kind of this oval shape and we'll make his for example his body is gonna be um, essentially a shape like this right and even the arms are gonna be um, a shape. And so I'm gonna, I'm, I can come in front of the, uh, the guitar here to just kind of show you. Um, but the arms, and I'm kind of having fun with these arms too, making them a little more round than they, than they normally would. Um, but essentially, they're, they're shapes just like that. And same with these, um, with his legs and his butt there. So we'll just kind of pull them out of here and We've got these kind of shapes, kind of tube type shapes. And I'm kind of having fun doing this thick and thin kind of thing going on. Um, but uh, let's see these shoes. I just kind of want to make this really, really fun and stylized. And right here we've got, he's going to be sitting on like an old wooden crate. And we've got his um, um, cane here tucked in there. I wonder if maybe I should... Yeah, I think I'll pull that in front here, and uh, so he knows where it is when he when he gets up from singing, and uh, just kind of lining it up here. I don't know what we'll do with the with the nose, but um, yeah, probably that's it. that's probably a good shape for the nose, and uh, the mouth here. I'm gonna just there we go. Connect his glasses there. Ear about right there. Back of the glasses, and I'm gonna make some hair here, um, and then I'm gonna put like a, a glass slide on his finger there, playing the blues with a with a slide guitar, and so his hands and fingers go about right here. Got to fit that around there. Just kind of doing this from memory here the headstock of the guitar that should all work so so essentially you know I've got I basically just got these shapes these two by the way would just be two circular or oval shapes and then we'll connect them for the guitar and a circle right here of course connect these right here and just got basically this long tube for the neck of the guitar and we'll clean it all up in our final in our finished art I want to have his hand here holding like a pick, so that should that's a pretty good hand shape. Other end of his shirt. Um, let's see, you want to kind of turn the corner with his um, jacket here, and same here. Try and get him about the same width, but make sure they wrap around behind his neck there, just to make it give it some volume and look three dimensional. His tie here. I'm going to give him a thin kind of tie and I'll work out all this other stuff um, once I let's see let's pull this line back here get this going here and maybe change that line let's have his his tip can I'm imagining that's like a old Folgers coffee can probably dating myself by saying that no I think Folgers is still out there I just don't drink it anymore but anyway so we'll make a, a tips jar or can here shadow on it uh, a little shadow cast by his shoes and his cane and probably got to cast a shadow of this we'll decide where to put the light later uh, the light source but for right now um, it's probably gonna be over here so we'll have something coming out of here little music stuff musical notes okay and then I can cut in this detail later on the uh, guitar Put his frets in here. Pick guard. Uh, let's see. Okay. 
um, on the top of his hat. Let's go right about right here. So that's another shape on top of his hat. You know, essentially this is just built on a on another um, shape like this, a, a, a cylinder that's kind of cut off. Um, and then that's the top part of the hat. And then the bottom part is just built by another um, oval shape, right? And his head fits right in in there. And the, the, you can line up the head knowing where these lines are, right? To determine where the head would be. So that's how you kind of build it. Um, okay, so let me erase that. And then I'm gonna move into, um, let me get a bigger eraser to do this faster. So I'm gonna get in here and um, uh, take the opacity down on this piece. And now I'm gonna basically um, just create one more layer and we're gonna start doing the art. So uh, I might even speed this up here now. I'll, I'll uh, let me get into the art real quick and then I may speed it up and just come back at the end. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and I think this one's gonna work pretty well, let's see. Yeah, that's a good that's a good line. Okay, so I'm gonna zoom in, and I'm gonna just speed this thing up and, and uh, create um, a guitar blues uh, player, um, a bluesman. So uh, here we go. I'll be back when I'm finished.
Okay, so there we have it. Uh, finished illustration. I'll go ahead and sign it here. But uh, I just want to show you my process from sort of start to finish. Um, rough sketch, typically use that blue line. I mean, I might even import a, uh, a sketch from, you know, a note or a sketchbook or whatever, it, you know, take a photo of it on my, um, with my iPhone, import it, you know, in here and then uh, draw, use that as my basic sketch and then draw over the top of that. But uh, this, in this one, I just uh, drew directly on my uh, drawing tablet here and, um, and then went to final sort of line art. I may do a colored version of this later, um, and I'll, if I do, I'll, I'll create a, uh, another little tutorial of that and show you how I color uh, images here in Photoshop and the various brushes that I use and what have you, but just want to show you my drawing technique and uh, sort of the steps I use um, to do this. Um, thanks for watching this one. Please uh, subscribe to my channel if you enjoy these and want to see more and let me know what you think and uh, I'll do some videos based on you know the input that I get. Um, thanks for watching and uh, have a great day. See you next time.